Good evening, everyone. Thank you for joining us tonight. Well, they are officially done with the Democratic Party. Seven Itawamba County officials formally switched their affiliation to the Republican Party today. They made that announcement this morning. Several high-ranking state Republicans made the trip to Fulton to welcome the members. Our Quentin Smith was at today's ceremony. He joins us now with more. Tommy, the Itawamba County Sheriff, Coroner, two constables, and three county supervisors are now the newest members of the Republican Party. The officials tell me they're happy with their new decision, and though they switched parties, they say serving the people and the community is still their number one goal. The Republican Party is uh, it's just a great party to be a part of. Itawamba County Coroner Sheila Summerford is just one of seven county officials switching to the GOP. I knew it was the right decision. You know, I knew that the Republican Republican Party was the right decision to run the 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 morals that they thinks that they do, the beliefs that they have, what they stand for. I mean, what they stand for is is. Uh, uh, things that I think everyone should stand for. Summerford says she's always been a Republican. However, when she ran for office last year, she had to run as a Democrat. At the time, I wouldn't be able to run for the sheriff or our supervisors or anyone there, so I had to run on the Democratic Party, but I am so glad we finally changed. And on hand to celebrate this change was Governor Phil Bryant and other elected officials a part of the Republican Party. I've made a lot of speeches on this square. And this one may have been the most important one. Itawamba County Sheriff Chris Dickinson did a lot of praying before making his decision. He says he has certain views that differ from that of the Democratic Party, which led him to making this choice. I don't have a lot of issues with the Democratic Party, don't get me wrong, but the criminal justice reform system that the Democratic Party is trying to implement concerns me, and that's why. Uh, I'm here today doing this. The sheriff says he knows this is a lifetime commitment, and though he's switching parties, he says it won't change the way he goes about doing his job. It just so happens that uh, sometimes you have to plant your feet, and I have that conviction, and I have planted my feet, and I hope to continue serving the people of this county. Now, along with Summerford and Sheriff Dickinson, Supervisors Charles Horn, Steve Moore, Steve Johnson, and Constables Doug Leslie and Terry Johnson also made the switch to the Republican Party. Andrea, back to you.